Okay, today we're going to be setting up your R4 Revolution for DS. We're going to set it up, we're going to add the kernel, and even demonstrate uh, one of the games playing. Okay, first thing you need to do is get your micro SD card adapter reader, and put your micro SD card in there. And now we're going to be putting it into the USB in our computer. Okay, now as you can see, the removal disk window popped up and we have some options here uh, you want to click open folder to view files okay this is our removable disk and right click on your mouse and some options are going to pop up I'm using Windows 7 it should be the same on Vista and XP so you're going to go right here where it says format click on format and we're going to go ahead and do a default on both settings, default accolation size, a quick format, start, push OK, format complete, push OK, close. Now that our micro SD card is formatted, we now go ahead and going to download the kernel. There's two kernels out there. You can either download the official kernel or the unofficial kernel. You can get both right here at filetrip.net. Uh, the link, um, the best kernel you can download right now is the Wood R4 kernel because the official kernel um, was last released in 2008, uh, which means. Um, all the games that have come out since then, as you can see right here, 2008, all the games that have come out since then probably won't play on that kernel. So you need a newer kernel, um, uh, which is what actually decrypts the games and is what actually will play the game. So you, the kernel you want to use is the unofficial kernel, Wood R4. The newest version out that's out right now is the Wood R4 1.10. So we're going to click on that. And then right here where it says download, selected version. We're going to go ahead and click download. And as you can see, it's downloading. Okay, now that my download is done, zip a JZIP file, which means it's a compressed file. I'm going to go ahead and double click on it. I'm going to go ahead and extract it. I'm going to extract it to my desktop. Okay, now that's done. Here's the my kernel right here. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to open it. And now you see here's your kernel. Now you want to go ahead and open open back up your removal disk by clicking on computer. Double click. Okay. This is my removal disk, which is my micro SD card double click on that okay, it's, it's empty as you can see still now I'm going to go ahead and add my kernel drag it over and it will automatically copy into it okay now that it's done copying I'm going to go ahead and exit this out now remember this is my removable disk micro SD card uh, next thing I'm going to go ahead and do is add a new folder. I'm going to call this folder Games. I'm going to add another folder. Call this folder Media. Okay. And now I need to install Moonshell version 2.10 stable. You go ahead and, we're going to go ahead and download that real quick. I'm going to go ahead and give you the link. I'm going to type in this code here. Download file. Okay, we're going to wait for this countdown to finish. Fast forward. Okay, now we can click on regular download. 
and as you can see right here it's it's downloading okay I already downloaded earlier so I'm gonna go ahead and stop that and it's right here on my desktop we're gonna do the same thing open it as you can see it's a compressed file we're gonna go ahead and extract it to our desktop okay now that it's done extracted onto my desktop as you can see it's right here we're gonna go ahead and add it to the micro SD card and let that copy okay first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna add a game to the games folder I'm gonna open my games folder by right double clicking I'm gonna add the Toy Story game that just came out okay now I'm gonna go ahead and add a media file open my media folder I'm gonna go ahead and add the um, music video okay now that is done I'm going to go ahead and go back and now we're going to go ahead and eject our micro SD card by going to right here where it says removable disk some options are going to come up go right here where it says eject you're going to click on eject now it says it's safe to remove hardware okay now we're going to take out our micro SD card from the adapter Okay, we're going to put it into our R4. I'm going to demonstrate this on a DS Lite since the R4 revolution only works on DS and DS Lite. Okay, as you can see, works just fine. I'm gonna go ahead and push start. I'll change the background, make it a little bit easier to see. Okay, I'm gonna click on micro SD. I'm gonna click on games folder. As you can see, there's Toy Story 3. I'm gonna click. Click A. Okay, but I'm gonna go, I don't want to make this too long, so I'm going to go ahead and go back and make sure my media player, Moonshell 2, is working just fine. Be to go back, scroll down where it says Moonshell 2, click there, and scroll all the way down to where it says Moonshell 2. Now you could even take this file out and put it in your game folder, that way you don't have to click into the Moonshell folder. I'll show you how to do that later. I'm going to go ahead and click A and launch that. Okay. Select English. Okay. Click OK. And click on my media folder this time instead of my games. Okay. This is Justin Bieber. It's a music video. And as you can see, it's playing just fine.